Can you store wind energy? You can't. You can't. You can't store electricity. It's a problem. But you see, what we've got to do is you've got to get something started. We have nothing mm -hmm. where we are right now. We're just sitting here. Mm -hmm. And it, we're getting worse off by the day. But what you can do with the wind, you know what you do is you, <clears throat> you have the wind mm -hmm. and it operates 40% of the time. That's about yeah. what our wind, wind yeah. we've done all this uh, met tower deal and, and measured it. And you have to then put something on top of it to level out the production. But I can tell you, if you start this, you will, they will figure out how to store it because we haven't had to do anything. You know what, why we haven't? The gasoline and oil have been so cheap. Well, it's that, never forced us to do anything. And now all at once, you know, it was really kind of like, send us the oil, never mind the price. Yeah. And well, then it, one day the price went like this. They said, well, wait a second. I didn't have this in mind. Well, and let's, let's, let's see, everything goes the way you want it. I, I know you can't give us a, a figure, but because there'll be less of a demand for gasoline, I'm assuming based on your plan that if you get what you want, the price of gasoline would go down. The gasoline price would go down if it was on that, if natural yeah. gas mm -hmm. replaced it. Mm -hmm. See, the thing about it, let me write on the back. Sure. Oh, back go ahead. Of, well, let me show you here on the board. The, see, uh, if you, uh, one MCF of natural gas. One MCF meaning? Uh, uh, million cubic, million cubic feet. feet. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Actually, yeah. But that equals eight gallons of gasoline. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's the same energy. Yeah. This is the same energy. Okay, so if it's $4, uh, the cost of gasoline, that's $32 an MCF, mm -hmm. right? That's right. Okay, this one MCF is now selling for $12. Okay, this is beautiful that you're gonna, you have so much room from there to there you know that you're going to be able to get your fuel cheaper. Oh, yeah. See what I mean? Yeah. Okay, what will happen, for instance, see, I have a, uh, I just bought a Honda GX, which is a natural gas vehicle. Mm. Okay. And they're installing today my device in my garage to fill it. So you'll be able to fill it at home? I'll you're, fill you're, it at home, and it'll cost me a dollar and fifty cents a gallon. <laughs> <laughs> but there's, you know, there's, Always when you get innovative, mm -hmm. there are several ways to skin a cat. Uh, the PETA people won't like for me to say that. That was just, uh, <laughs> to, but, but, you know, but you can solve a problem if you get sit down and go to work on the problem and you have resources to work with. And we do. We have the natural gas to work with and we should work with it. A lot of this view is incentive too, isn't it? I mean, uh, some of the plans that you keep hearing are, well, the government needs to spend this and this and that. What you really said is, no, what we really need is private investment. Because once you make this, yeah. uh, make people realize that this can be done and they can make money, uh, they're going to go after it. That's right. But you have everything working for you here. You've got the domestic fuel cheaper than gasoline yeah. and diesel. Gasoline and diesel are, and oil, all of those things mm -hmm. are the same. But you're importing all of those at a very high price and you have a natural resource in the United States, it's cheaper. Now, you're gonna to have to do a little figuring on it. And first thing, you say, well, I'm go I wanna go down and, and buy a Cadillac. Well, a Cadillac uh, is not designed to mm -hmm. take natural gas. But if General Motors knew that you were gonna buy a Cadillac and, a, and thousands of other people were, I promise you, they can get you the car. Ford, Chrysler are the same. Don't let it go to Honda, Toyota, and everybody else, Mercedes and BMW. They have those cars in Europe. Mercedes and BMW have those cars. And so what's going to happen when they see that the American people are going to be willing to make that switch? And they will. The American people understand that then those vehicles will come to us. So it's all going to work. <laughs> Just stick with me. Oh, yeah. Okay. Thank you. Appreciate right. you. You bet.